If you're looking for a resin 3D printer, then you may have heard of the Elegoo Mars. This machine retails for $369 and is able to produce stunning 3D prints. It's surprising how user-friendly this 3D printer is, which can't be said about every 3D printer we review. My name's Joe from MakeUseOf.com and let's see what it can do. The Mars is a compact desktop 3D printer. It's controlled via a color touchscreen and the included USB flash drive. It's small enough to fit on your desk or into small spaces and the UV blocking cover is easily removed to allow quick access to the machine. It features a 1 inch per hour maximum print speed, 100 micron layer heights, 2560 by 1440 2K 5.5 inch LCD, 3.5 inch color touchscreen, 40 watt UV LED bulb and it uses stereolithography or SLA 3D printing technology. This machine features a dual colour scheme. The bottom third is constructed from metal and houses all the electronics, power input and control panel. The top two thirds are dedicated to the resin bat, z-axis and bed. The 2K display provides excellent XY resolution and in theory is twice as detailed as printers using a 1080p or lower resolution display. It's not possible to control this printer from your computer or over the network but the included flash drive comes with pre-sliced files ready to print. Almost all of the mechanical parts of this machine are made from metal with the exception of the resin bat thumb screws and the bed release thumb screw. The bed and resin that are easily removed without any tools and this makes it quick and easy to get up and running. Running a 3D printer with a bat full of sticky resin plastic can seem daunting at first but Elegoo makes this process extremely simple. The setup process far exceeds the standard set by the competition and it's more work configuring a new gadget such as a mobile phone or games console than using this printer. Before you can begin any prints you must level the bed. This doesn't need doing often but it does need doing at least once. This involves undoing a screw, removing the vat, placing a piece of paper on the LCD and then the printer does the rest for you. This takes a few seconds and then you tighten up the screws. This process is a joy to perform and it far exceeded my expectations of what is required from such a budget machine. Once leveled you can install the vat, top up the resin, place the UV cover in place, insert the flash drive and begin the test print. This test print takes roughly four hours to complete, which is about on average for this printer for small models. High quality prints are worth waiting for and with a speed of one inch per hour, you may need to leave this printer running overnight. After four hours, the test print emerges dripping from its resin bath, like some kind of swamp monster. It's fascinating to watch, and for me, this test print worked first time. Prints produced by this machine are mind-blowing, and this is the biggest benefit of an SLA printer. Layer lines are almost invisible, and microscopic details that would be impossible for an FDM printer to produce come out clear and sharp. Due to the limited bed size, this printer is best suited to smaller models or those with intricate fine details. The test model contains intricate castle turrets and fine text along with miniature stairs which are produced to a very high level of detail for such a small size. This 3D printer really shines producing wargaming minis or other small figures. The fine detail reproduction is perfect for the intricate details required by minifigures and terrain and tiny details such as rings, moustaches, belts, boots and so on are perfectly produced. As the prints are submerged in a bath of uncured resin, they need some cleaning up after printing. This isn't difficult, but you do have to purchase even more additional equipment not provided in the box. You need to wash the uncured resin off using rubbing alcohol, and then you need to finish curing the prints either in the sun or with a cheap UV curing station. You'll also need to wear gloves and a mask when handling the resin or the uncured prints, as it's sticky stuff. The Elegoo Mars comes with Chitubox slicing software. This free program converts your 3D models into specific machine instructions. This slicer is a dream to use. It's a really friendly software interface and it lets you easily arrange print jobs, generate supports, adjust settings and check final print layers. It's also very fast to slice your models and stable as well. It rarely struggles or hangs even with big files. The Elegoo Mars is a stunning resin 3D printer. And while the price tag of $369 seems steep when compared to the range of affordable FDM 3D printers, it represents an excellent entry point into ultra high detail 3D printing. When you compare it to resin competitors such as the Formlabs Form 3, these machines can cost upwards of $3,000, so $369 almost represents a bargain. Resin 3D printing is not for everyone, it's very slow 
and the build volume can be limiting. Uncured resin smells and every part needs cleaning up after printing. It's not difficult to do this, but if you lack the space or the inclination to do it, you may be best served looking for another printer. If you've got the space and you're happy to clean up prints, then this machine is a dream to use. It requires very little maintenance, has only one moving part and is almost plug and play. You no longer have to worry about printer maintenance, but you can focus on cool 3D models to solve your problems. Thanks for watching, and as always, make sure you leave a like and a comment down below telling us what you think of the Elegoo Mars 3D printer. Subscribe to make use of it if you've not done so already for more news, tutorials, reviews and giveaways. And make sure you visit our link in the description below where you can read our full review. If you're still watching this review, we're giving away a brand new Mars LCD 3D printer thanks to our friends at Elegoo. To be in with a chance of winning, our link in the description below will take you to our giveaway contest at the end of our written review. To gain an extra entry into our contest, enter the code RESIN into the box.